Hello and welcome and inviting you to learn these two super easy acupressure points to help your cramps naturally in under 10 minutes. So every week I release a new video based on using acupressure and other natural remedies to help with period symptoms. So please hit the bell and subscribe and share anything relevant. Sorry, that's my cat. And uh, you know, use these to help take back your body and really enjoy it again. And if we haven't met yet, my name is Kyla Plaxton and I have used acupressure to transform my period symptoms to superpowers. And this is what the whole channel is about. So welcome. Okay, so this very first acupressure point is found in the groin. So I'm just gonna show you a close up picture here because it's a little bit awkward for me to do on video. I have to pretzel my body and, and move the screen and I'm just not very good at techie. So I'm just gonna show you a picture and Basically, how you measure it is from the outside of the hip bone and the inside of the pubic part, the pubic bone, and then you go right in between. But honestly, it's so tight in that area, and with all acupressure points, you can press within uh, at least a nickel and it will still work. So, um, as long as you're following the acupressure technique, um, you can be close to the area, it doesn't have to be precise, and it's still going to make a difference for you. So um, when you find that pressure point, I always recommend to hold it and take it a nice deep breath. You can pause this video, just kind of go in there and you want to be able to push it for, um, you know, as hard as you can feel it, but not so hard that your body goes into a defensive mode. It's often like a, it hurts so good type of feeling that comes with acupressure points. Then you wanna hold it still, don't wiggle around. It's not massage, it's acupressure. So it's on the vortex of the energy and you're holding the points and then just taking a couple nice deep breaths. And also you can do it on both sides. So most acupressure points are bilateral, meaning they're on both sides of the body. So often you can take one finger for one on one side and one finger for the other on the other side and kill two birds with one stone, make it highly more effective and super duper powerful. Okay, so that's the, that's the first acupressure point. And I'm just really curious how that's going for you. If, you, if you're finding the acupressure point um, easy enough or if you're having troubles, um, if you have any questions, just put in the comment below. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you're finding it or if you're having a hard time. So we're gonna go into the next acupressure point and this one is in the hip. So again, I'm gonna show you a picture. Um, the stuff, you know, in the middle of the region can be a little bit awkward, um, I, you know, maybe we'll get into models and stuff like that, but for now, you can see it in the picture just fine, and again, you're going to find it from the outside of the hip bone, and then just go in like a diagonal, kind of to the biggest, um, meaty part of the hip. And again, I would use my thumbs here because it is so meaty, and you want to just push in on both sides of the hips, and, um, take that time to breathe, pause the video, just be with it, you know, for three, four long, slow, deep breaths, you kind of can go into a meditative state, really just slow down and take this opportunity to just be with yourself. Between these two pressure points, the groin point and the hip point, you're gonna find a lot of relief. You'll be able to feel the movement, you'll find some tem tenderness, maybe a bit of achiness, but if you're feeling that, that's great. If you're feeling it, it means that stuff is starting to move. One other great thing to do after you've held some pressure points on yourself is to take a nice Epsom salt bath, go for a nature walk. You really wanna ground in and just allow that energy to just sink in and really find that stillness. Great job. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up, thumbs down and share it with somebody. If you know somebody dealing with cramps, which lots of women do, uh, please share this video and let's keep helping each other, helping women and uh, turning our periods into something really, truly beautiful. Um, that is my goal for you. So you can sign up for uh, the Unlock the Menstrual Clo Code 30 minute class and I go into a lot deeper some of the theories of how to access period symptoms and really start to get answers from within and use them to benefit yourself. So it's absolutely free. Uh, there's a click uh, link below in the description and I hope to see you there.